Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. Jim, you've played in games of this nature, who can make the difference? Yeah, Timo Werner. He's quick and direct, Peter, loves to play on the shoulder of the last defender, and he's always looking to make that run in behind. I think having someone like that up front makes the opposition defences think twice about playing such a, a high line and pushing them deeper can create space, of course, for midfield, so he can be a real troublemaker. Well, quite no argument for me on that one. The action has already started. And the shot! That's offside, yes it is. Keeper's got good distance on that. And a shot! Oh, the ball's come loose! Hoists it forward, and now they can launch a counter. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And that's put paid to a promising move. Oh, it's hit the post! Goal! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. He was so alert to the possibilities there, great stuff. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. Zenit St. Petersburg, go ahead, one goal to the good. Here it comes, Zayak. And it's Conte. Werner. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself, lovely to see. Malcolm. Chelsea are already chasing the game, long time to go. The only consolation... Asmoon! Oh, he couldn't get hold of it. Rudiger. Werner. He's got away. Werner. Header! It's come back out! That's a half decent try. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And it's played forward. He's there to receive it. Hits one! It's broken. He can count on that. No mistake! They have grabbed themselves an equaliser. 
Chilwell did well there. He was onto it in a trice. Oh, that's great awareness. Full marks to him as he was just that bit quicker than everyone else on the follow-up. Chelsea grab the equaliser and we're all square. Look, get your seatbelts on because this is showing all the signs of another roller coaster ride. Forward it goes. Conte. And it's Chilwell. Chilwell, midway through the first period, and it's looking quite a game here. And Sayak! That carried quite a threat. Juba. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Rudiger goes looking. Werner. Now it's Lukaku. Werner gets away from his opponents. Big chance! It's anyone's ball. Oh, real danger here. And that has been clubbed away. Conte, and here's Lukaku, tries to get it forward quickly, with a delicate ball, Christensen, Chilwell already of course on the score sheet, Werner, and here's Lukaku, A foul, simple decision for the referee. Now, can he finish? Well, oh, Red, he sorted that out. Jorginho. And it's Zayek. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Dashing forward at pace. Keeps everyone guessing. Kante gets it away. This could spell danger. That's been leave it clear. That's it back. It's a loose ball. And the referee brings the first half to a close. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. And we are up to the break. Oh, what a half of football. It's 1-1, but it could easily be 3-3 or, or more. Breakneck speed brilliance. So, both teams heading off for the break, an interesting game has brewed up here, hoping perhaps for a little bit more from both parties in the second half, but the score at half-time is 1-1. And we are already promptly back on the way. Chilwell. Chilwell drives it forward. Mm. 
Malcolm. Asmoon. Juba. Into the channel. Malcolm. Deflected behind for a corner kick. Rakitsky with the short one. Defence has got rid of that. Zenit St. Petersburg making a fresh attempt to release someone in behind from back to front. And this is something different. has only enhanced his already huge reputation. They were obviously hoping for an early second half boost, but there are a few who can truly make it happen. And this is a very welcome tonic now. Simplicity itself. That's just a great finish, but it's down to very clever movement. You can see this has been obviously worked on on the training ground. He knew exactly where he wanted the ball, and it all came good. Chelsea get themselves into the lead. Yeah, they deserve great credit for turning things around, but they'll now need the defensive resilience to equal that attack and flair. Uh, needed a better pass there. And the shot! <laughs> Two to the good! They have breathing space! Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. And that's what the game is all about. Find space and finish, but we have to credit the pastor to pick him out. Chelsea take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. And here's Lukaku. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. <laughs> Chelsea have scored two quick goals here and are firmly in control at 3-1. Juba. Loose ball, who's going to get that? Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Zenit at St. Petersburg, and very keen on the aerial route. Look, if you're good at it and instructed to carry on doing it, then you find a way of making it work, and they are. Rudiger. Kante goes looking. Werner gets it back. And that's clear cut. It's a free kick. As Asmoon just sails past the upright. Asmoon nearly produced a moment of magic. He knew the strike was pure. They're 
actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get... And Zayek! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Zayek simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Jorginho. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, and they finally reacted, but they could have been more switched on before he, he scored. Hasmoon. Werner. Chilwell is charging up on the overlap. Gets up to head it! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Looks to thread it through. And that has been cleared. Asmoon. He's looked long this time. And he's cut it out. Chilwell. Jorginho. Cuts it out. Plays it out to the wing. Malcolm! Now a chance to break. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Board shows there will be three extra minutes. Just brushed off the ball there. Shoots! Werner, who does have an assist to his name. Nothing battles to win it back. And he has been fouled there. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. Rudiger. Deftly done. And that will be the final act. Chelsea winners after an absolutely outstanding game. Fabulous drama as they dragged it back from behind, made it happen and won. Would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Well, they approached this with a very definite game plan, and I think to a large extent they remain true to that. And